dependent and independent variables. So an independent variable is the input value of a function. And the dependent variable is the output variable of the function. And the dependent variable depends on the independent variable. So in an equation, something like y equals 2x plus 1, whatever the subject is will be your dependent variable and whatever is not the subject is the independent variable. Let's have a look. If we make a little table of values out of this. Remember, x goes on the top, y goes on the bottom. Let's do 0, 1, 2. And you can see already that once we fill this in, we're depending on the values of y from our x values. So these are independent, and these ones are depending on what these values are. So we can put those into the formula. So when x is 0, we get 2 times 0, which is 0, plus 1 is 1. When x is 1, we get 2 times 1, which is 2, plus 1 is 3. When x is 2, we get 2 times 2, which is 4, plus 1 is 5. And when we go to plot this out on a graph, on a number line, number plane, sorry, Cartesian plane, we have x and y. And always, our x-axis is always where our independent variable goes, and our y-axis is where our dependent value goes. In real-life examples, if you're ever dealing with time as one of the variables, time is always an independent variable, because time doesn't depend on anything. Time always moves forward. And then now we can plot out our values on our independent and dependent axis. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. We can plot our points out. So zero, one will be here. One, three will be here. And two, five will be up there. And we can see our relationship of a straight line where x is independent of y. Thank you.